Hey guys, it's Rose. And Angela. And, and we're, we're the, the Treasure, treasure vixens. vixens. We're a little crooky. Yeah. They're... Wait, wait, let me fix us more. There we go. Yeah. Why are we not level? It's it's uh, it's not our normal stuff, guys. It's a different equipment. Yeah. Right. Right. <laughs> <laughs> Be nice to us. Yeah. Um, so, uh, and we're the Treasure Vixens. Did we do that part? Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Okay. Yeah. All right. Moving on. Welcome back for another Tuesday, um, whatever we want video. I'm liking Tuesdays. <laughs> Um, what was I going to say? Today we're going to be doing a gemstone pay dirt review. Yeah, and so, guys, Rose has been doing this gemstone stuff for quite a while, and um, the gold pay dirt mm -hmm, stuff, mm -hmm. um, funny thing is, is that she didn't realize that I was interested in it, and she's been doing it on her own, yeah. and then I was like, why am I not being asked to help? And she was like, well, I didn't know, I didn't know. Yeah, it was so, just... Even best friends miscommunicate. <laughs> oh, just not talk about it is what it is. We I just, think that's what it was. Yeah. Like, I was letting her do her own thing, thinking she wanted it to be her own thing, but really she wanted me to be included, but just thought I wasn't, didn't want to be a part of it. So we were respecting each other while unknowingly not respecting each other. Which is so funny because our last video, we did an intro together, but I had filmed that video by myself and I got a hold of her afterwards and I was like, this was so lame. <laughs> I, was, I was. I was like, like it's not fun. Why don't you let me record it? She's yeah. like, do you want to? And I was mm -hmm. like, of course I do. I want to be part of it. So here we are. Um, of course, at this point, since Rose has been doing it so long, she's much more knowledgeable about all of this stuff than I am. Well, it's way more than me. I would still put myself in novice, but super novice. Right. So I'm going to be learning along with you guys. Mm -hmm. And... Um, are we going to get right into it now? Is that all we... Oh, well, we want to talk about uh, who who this gemstone bag is from. Yep. So this is um, my first time purchase from Metamora Gem Mind. Uh, and they, it looks like they're based out of Indianapolis. And I want to give a little bit of a shout out to Gemstone Judy and HD Shovel Ed because they're the ones who turned me on to Metamora. In particular, Judy even pulled up their website for me to kind of let me preview what they had. Um, is when we were hanging out at Flash Bash 2021. And um, I knew, like I told her, I was like, I'll let you know when the order comes in and how's it go, how it goes. So I just wanted to say thanks, Judy. I really appreciate it. And I really hope that we get the opportunity to meet up with you and Ed sometime at Absolutely. this place. Absolutely. Yeah. Uh, both of those people are excellent people, guys. Mm -hmm. um, I know we rave about everybody, but... We got a great community. Exactly. Yeah. It's easy to <laughs> rave about you guys. So uh, this is from Metamora Gem Mine. A few things that I'd like to let you guys know right off the bat is we haven't even opened the box that it came in. So we are like literally unveiling the box. I spent, um, I want to give you price points. I purchased the, uh, should have been a little more prepared. Um, they're they're going to wait. It's okay. Yeah. Yeah. They just like looking at our lovely faces. Yeah. I purchased the, the, the Big Show. Ooh. This is called the Big Show. This is the biggest bucket that they have. They have, and their prices range from, I'd say, I believe. Look how that one, like, that's expensive. $25 all the way up to $165. Which guess, is, guess how much that one was. <laughs> the Big Show did cost $165, and I paid, I think, about $25 for shipping. But... They shipped with um, UPS, and their shipping was freaky fast, you guys. Freaky fast. I ordered on a Monday. I got it on a Wednesday. My payment was still pending in the bank account. And I think oh. that's that's going to be important, as I want to talk to you about shipping, because some of the other reviews we're going to do, we may, waited much longer to have the products arrive. So I'm going to try to let you guys know who they use. This was freaky fast. Let's see if they're freaky good. Yeah, their website is also super easy to navigate, has clear prices all over it. I had no questions on what I was ordering. I was super excited about it and was just able to just order it. And I think I even created a user account so it remembers me because I will definitely be ordering other options that they have on this website. They have a whole, um, not a bucket, but a whole bag of um, black light um, fluorescent oh, gems. Yeah. So all of them, like, and some of them look really ugly, but then you put the fluorescent light to them and they all really light cool. up. And they, fossil bags, you can purchase stones from them. I think they even have some clothing that you can get, some hippy-dippy clothing. I swear yeah, I you're right. It's a lot of cool stuff. So definitely check out the website, which will be in the description below. Um, other than that, I think it's about time to 
put on hands and yeah. some dirt. This bo oh, this box is so heavy. There's a warning on the box, you guys. And maybe I'll try to record Angela. Does it require you to wear a back brace? You would definitely need a back brace for this box. It came in the bucket where when you order other buckets from sites, they put them in bags and then put them in a box uh -huh, and then ship yeah, them. Yeah. This is in the bucket. Oh, and like like a like a um, collector's mm -hmm. bucket. Yeah, we'll be able to use a bucket later on. Nice. Yeah, reduce, reuse, recycle. <laughs> <laughs> that just like spilled off your tongue so easily. Yeah. <laughs> I was a part of the recycling club when I was a kid. Oh, um, that that's awesome. I, I don't loved think it. we had a recycling yeah. club. It was in Alaska. Mm -hmm. They took it a little bit more seriously than they do here. Yeah. Uh, okay, yeah, so let's get at it. Um, maybe I'll give you guys a little shot of Angela picking up this bucket. Oh. It's going to be funny. Okay. I'm going to roll my sleeves up for mm -hmm. it. Yeah. Okay. Get her muscles. Can we get a close-up of this real yeah. quickly? Yeah, look. Look. It says, caution, heavy. 35 pounds and over. They're not joking around about it either, okay? You guys ready for this? Bam, look at those muscles. Loki's gonna help. Uh, Don't mind the mess, guys. You never get to see that part. Uh, <laughs> Do be careful. Uh, okay. I need to get a hernia. <laughs> Hemorrhoids <laughs> and hernias. All right, she's got this though. She's, yep. Yep. Are you getting right. close up on my muscles? Yep. Bam. Oh, they look great. They look so good. <laughs> okay. Right in the middle of the kitchen. That's okay. perfect. Where do you want it? That's what she said. Okay. Well done. Thanks. Now we're going to get set up for you guys. Okay. So, um. I don't know. You're just like flinging that knife around. <laughs> for, for, it's a scissors. It's part of the scissors. Uh, it looks so deadly. dangerous. <laughs> Okay, so a few tips that I would uh, probably recommend is you're definitely going to want a sifter. And I got this off of one of my first ever um, gemstone pay dirt reviews from Sleuth Boy Prospecting. It came with it. And then I filled up a spare bucket here with water. And this is what we're going to rinse in. So we're going to bring in dirt, put it in here, rinse, and then we'll put our treasures in here. We're not going to um, give you commentary the whole time, guys, because this is going to take us a hot minute. So we're going to go through it together, and then we'll talk about what we find in between. Or yeah. maybe we'll pause and talk about a few of the really cool we're, ones. You know, we're pretty good at magnet yeah. fishing and filming, but yeah. this is going to be a learning process for brand us. Brand new. Yeah, brand right. new. So um, let me just, you guys can have the satisfaction. Uh, I love the sound of that. Yep. Okay. I'm excited to see this bucket. Yeah, me too. Don't cut your fingers off. No, I was like, cut away from yourself. There Ooh, it's like a paint bucket. Yep. We got some informational stuff. I think, yeah, identification oh, cards. Nice. So always, always a bonus. Yeah. yeah, there's a lot. And it's color. Oh, and it's got fossils. They sell fossils too. Oh, yeah, you side. can just fossil buckets. That's the fossily side. Yep. All right. Oh, more fossils. Oh. Yeah. Oh, here. Let's get a close up of that. Um, they have the on the other sheet. Sorry, guys. I'm like not filming mm -hmm. anything, but I give you guys oh, a perfect. close up of that. Perfect. Okay. I think your dog is stanky. He's got a stinky butt. <laughs> Lift with your knees. Lift with your knees. Yeah. Nope. Oh, let me hold this down Thank for you. you. Yeah. Nice. That's, that's a bucket. Uh, Rose and I just had the conversation off camera about, guys, do tell us if anybody knows who was the genius who thought of putting a small little handle on a heavy paint bucket. Why don't, why aren't they bigger? Something you could hook your arm around or. Yeah. You can let us know. Right. Who's that inventor? <laughs> Sealed up nicely. Yeah, it looks like there's taper on that, huh? Oh, there's this perfect part left for me to pull off, and I just stuck it down. Oh. Back up here a bit. There we go. Okay. Oh, I'm so excited. Ba, ba, ba. Oh, that's a tractor supply bucket. Yeah. yeah. Oh, you can only already see some goodies. Yep. Look at all them goodies, guys. That's like pink and shiny. Oh, that's bubble wrap. <laughs> I was like, it's pink and shiny rock. Oh. oh. 
my goodness. Oh, what is it, Rose? What is it? Okay. I gotta take my ring off. Hold on a second. Okay. And get some scissors. That'd be smart. And we're back. What could it be? What could it be? I'm taking a baggy bag. Oh, it's like geodish. Look at me being all smart, guys. I know something. Yeah, she knows a lot. Don't listen to her. <laughs> that is gorgeous. Beautiful display piece. Heck it needs yeah. a little cleaning, guys. Yeah. It's obviously dirty, but once you get that thing cleaned up, it's going to sparkle. It's going to be gorgeous. Go. Which you guys will get to see eventually. Yeah. We're going to show you. Right. That's gorgeous. And here, pull that pink piece out. Look at there's a little something just oh my God. waiting I to can't be wait. discovered. Okay. All right. So is that? Yeah. At this point, we'll just set the camera up and get through it. Okay. Leggies, leggies and feet, leggies and feet. Luckily, I shaved. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Okay. What are you doing? Oh well, we do see this big beautiful piece right here. Why don't you just grab it on out, wash it off, and show these guys? Well, I'm gonna get my. Identification card out so I can sound like I know what I'm talking about. It's one of those Labradite. I'm not sure. I don't know, but it's blue and I love blue. It is beautiful. Um, I don't think aquamarine. I'm gonna put this here for the drippies yeah. so I can show you guys. And not worry about dripping. I need like a low cut shirt for this. Oh. You see, like oh, low cut yeah. shirt would be perfect. <laughs> <laughs> I think that's blue appetite. That's my guess. I have an appetite for destruction. <laughs> <laughs> I have an appetite for dinner. Oh, I thought you were going to say something else that begins with a D. <laughs> <laughs> you guys can insert whatever you thought it was. Don't put it in the comments, though. Don't do it. <laughs> oh, yeah. You'll get in trouble. <laughs> okay. All right. So, now... Why don't you scoop just in, if your hands hurt, we'll try to figure out a different way, but just fill that sucker up. If you make a mess, we came to the kitchen so we can sweep up our mess, guys. She's a, an experienced dirt monger. Okay, so check out this nasty pile of stuff right here. We're just going to give it a quick wash in the bucket. Oh, look what I just found! Another oh, one. one. Yeah. Okay, hang tight, guys. There so after some wrenching, we're going to start crazy. Okay. Damn. I believe, even without my identification card, that's Jasper, I think. Got some Jaspers, and that is probably a fluorite or a calcite. If Benzo's watching this, I bet you we're going to drive him crazy. Probably. <laughs> Look at this pretty blue one. Oh, yeah. Oh, where's the camera? Look at that. That looks really pretty in the camera, too. It's, like, glowing. I love how we're like, let's not commentate. Let's just get through it. Okay. Like, right, right, right. No, oh. I'm doing it, too, guys. I want to show. I, we want to show you guys. These are all beautiful. But, yeah, let's, let's get moving because there's a lot. Well, after, actually, after this let me get you scissors we'll do a couple pans like this yeah. and then we're just gonna bust through it and then show you guys the results of everything we're just learning as we go I scissors. Yeah. I think I found another one there's all these pink packages in here okay I lost the scissors two pink packages They're right here, silly, on the floor. Oh, well, you know what? Those were terrible anyways, and I bet you... Oh. I bet you these would be better. Everybody in the, watching was like, they're right there, Rose! <laughs> Just kidding! <laughs> here, go ahead. I'm, like, really sandy. Okay. All right. These are sealed with care. They're really... They wanted these to come in one piece. You can tell that they cared about these pieces right here. It's the true treasure. I love how, we're, are we going to do this a lot? 
<laughs> That's a lot of dirt. Oh yeah. And you know, I've heard rumors that you can go through and pan through this um, dirt dirt, look for cons, and maybe even find a little gold. So I've kept all mine, but I haven't gone through it. Is, is that true? Like, I don't know. They don't just go out to the field or the creek. Oh, well, I guess if they get um, creek dirt, well, yeah, you can find gold there. It's there. possible, yeah. Mm. Or maybe there was water there at one point. Maybe, um... I think what my point is is that it's obvious that they're not just scooping truckloads of dirt mm -mm. and then all these gems are in it. Agreed. They're collecting the dirt and yep. then throwing the gems in it yep. to make a fun adventure for us. Solely for the treasure victims. This oh. was done just for treasure victims. This thing is just this thing is just wrapped up. Okay. Oh. 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 Look at that. It's so small. Is this a, is this an agate? It's pretty. Look at that, you guys. Let me um, come up there. Oh, I am already so happy. <laughs> Great. This is going to go in our office. Yay. Here we go. Which is finally in the works, guys. Yeah, we're like, we're working on it. It's getting there. It's getting there. Yeah. Ready? I'm just kidding. Yeah. I'm dirty. I'll, I'll rinse. Let's see, rinse. Oh, sorry. This is crazy. That looks like it could be a cup. I like the surprise um, factor. Oh, I think, yeah, this is one of those selenites. Oh my gosh. I love these. Here. Yep. Yeah. Selenites can't get wet. Oh, and they've got it wrapped up. Oh, it's a votive holder. Oh my gosh. They, can't, is, they can't get wet? Yeah, selenite is, uh, oh. well, I'm sure you can get it a little wet, but I know that water is very corrosive to selenite. Look at that, you guys. So, candle in here. Oh, yeah. This is so cool. That's huge. I bet it looks really pretty when the boat starts to get, uh, like, short. Oh, yeah. And then the light is shining through it. I just so happen to have some votives sitting in my living room right what? now. Mm -hmm. All right. Okay. All right. Now, guys, we're going to get to it. Okay. Cue the music. out of this video before it's over I just want to put this in here um, they sent us this little thing and it's like a thanks for being a customer and if you I'm gonna read it to you it says we wish to thank those that take time to create a video or post that aids us in our advertising effort if we see an influx of sales directly re related to your actions we will be sending you a free gift so guys we're gonna put the link um, to Metamora down below in the description um if you'd like to go and make a purchase from this wonderful gem mine place then click the link and do it through that link because then we'll, we'll get a little gift um which is going to create another video for you guys because yeah go ahead. i was to say also if you guys don't use the link or you're just on there don't be afraid to tell them i'm sure they'll say how did you hear about us i wish i had yeah. checked that when i bought it but don't be afraid to say the treasure vixens sent you that way 
Yeah, because, you know, uh, like that would be um, money towards another bag for us to create another video for you guys. So that would be very helpful. Yep. All right, so um, I guess now, now we're... Now we're going to show these, oh, okay. and then right. they're going to, you guys are going to have to wait for those. <laughs> right. <laughs> okay, that's smart. We're just going to pick a few favorites. You know, you guys got to, I think I slowed down for this big one. This is a huge I chunk. I love that. Of rose quartz. And I am, I'm going to break this apart. And tumble it. Oh, yeah. Why would you do that? Because I can. <laughs> maybe I won't. Maybe this, maybe this will be sitting in the office for Angela to look at. <laughs> I love, like, quartz is one of my favorites. I love quartz. But these pieces could be uh, museum quality pieces. You could sit them out and display them, or you can break these apart yourselves, especially if you're learning how to tumble and you're needing to fill up a, um, a barrel. These can be broken apart and tumbled. I've done that with a few other batches myself. I can't believe it! <laughs> this, uh... <laughs> This is a, I think a honey citrine right there. Look at that. No, yeah, yeah, I do think that's a honey citrine. Super soft, doesn't tumble well. And citrine is my birthstone. Oh. It also uh, is uh, commonly associated with luck and, and wealth and luck. Did you know that? I, I'm uh, not rich monetarily, <laughs> yes. but I'm very rich in friendship. Word. <laughs> okay, let's just see some, some of your favorites. Oh, I thought this one was so funky. I was wondering if it was a tooth. Is it a? Oh, this bag doesn't have fossils. Does not. It's, it's just did. gemstones. So it's a. It's a. It doesn't look like a gemstone per no. se, but it's a rock of some sort. When um. Man, I don't know. We we might have to call in the big guns and ask Benzo. Yeah, I don't see that on there anywhere. And it's just so weird. That's that formation. Like, it looks uh, like it uh, formed that way. Yeah. Okay. I'm gonna agree with that. We're, we're going to give it its own name. We're going to call it Toothstone. I love it. Thanks. <laughs> Toothstone. <laughs> Wonderful. Now, we've got some... Well, we're just going to pick this. I always... Yeah. Like, Tiger's Eye, I'm always fascinated with Tiger's Eye. Any of those that have, like, the mirror-esque quality to them, I... Like, my eye is drawn to them. I don't know if you guys feel the same way, but... Yeah, I definitely like the ones that are like shiny and mirror-esque. I think that's a piece of moonstone. I wonder how well this is going to capture. Oh, there we go. Yeah. Oh, yeah, I do think that's moonstone. Yeah, some moonstones. Lots of little green opals. Lots of them in here. I know this one. <laughs> I know that one. What is it? It's moss agate. That is correct. And that tumbles really well and looks really, uh -huh. really pretty. Very easy to tumble. I bet this is part of... This is two stone. Yeah. Uh huh. Yeah, that's like a root back there, though. So but we, yeah, we know what this one is. It's not obsidian. What's this one? That's obsidian. Obsidian's more like a glass. Right. And this is more like a charcoal. Yeah. We've come across those before, and on other identification papers, we've had it's been in there, yeah. but I don't remember what it was called when we went to that one mine where we. Uh huh. On our road trip, yeah, that it was, was on that one. Blue Springs Caverns. Line. Yeah, yeah. Okay. Um, I'm just gonna pick some of these out. They're not necessarily gonna... my favorite, but once again, these are some jaspers. I believe these are jaspers. And they're so pretty when they're tumbled and or wet because those stripes really pop. Also, very easy to tumble. Ah. I'm trying to point out the ones that I've just had a lot of success with. These guys always come out beautiful. And you can mix them in with other stones. They just seem to, to do just They're fine. They're happy little stones. Mm -hmm. So easy. Okay, any other favorites? Um, I'm always drawn to the blue and the green ones. I'm, like, always. And so. there, yeah, there is not, I mean, they have a healthy mix of stones in here. Yeah, there really is. Uh, these aqua, what are these called? Because I always love these. I believe that's a. And they're so pretty when they're tumbled, too. The calcite. I don't know, guys. Now, now we're getting a little. Oh, put her on the spot. Oh, and I've got to sneeze. Bless you. Thank you. Okay. Oh, there's some. There, there's it. Like, what's cave onyx? We didn't get any of that, but that is cool looking. Um, zebra jasper. I don't know, guys. We'll have to do a little bit more investigating for you. Oh, peacock ore. That seems to. All, every single one of them says that they contain peacock ore, and I've only gotten it once. Oh, I love that stuff. Super rare yeah. stuff. 
Okay. Well, I don't want to. I don't want to just st stare here and look at this. So, did you you showed the other? We showed these big ones already. Yeah, this one. Well, this we, one we yeah. didn't really. Yeah, give it a show. Good. Look at that one's pretty. Oh, the light is a little bit bright, but see, it's got two terminating crystals on that big chunk. That's yeah. pretty cool. For shizzle. Any any other ones that I just love, love, love? Ooh. Ew. Weird. This is like a. I wonder if this is still moss agate. I don't. That's pretty opaque. Like it's it's uh. That one is questionable. Where's that? I want to see that paper. Oh, there you go. I like that one. That one's unique. It's like is a it crocodile jasper. Maybe that's what I was like. Is it green quartz? Okay. It looks like a quartz, but it was green, and I have never seen that. Did they say green quartz on there? Yeah. Oh, I see. Yep. Oh, that shiny one is a green mica. Where did that guy go? It's like a little sliver. He's hiding. Not on there. Hiding, hiding from me. It's a lot. There's so much. Yeah, there's so much, guys. Like, I'll spend quite a bit of time actually sorting through these and separating these. And when I do, I'm going to notice pieces that I didn't notice when I was talking to you guys. Angel's going to notice pieces. You know, they just yeah. they just kind of pop out because there's so many to go through. And so they're drying now, and they really are a lot easier to identify when they're wet. Mm -hmm. like the, the, they, the colors just stand out a lot better Keep and the patterns and stuff. Keeping a little bowl of water next to you guys right. while you go through them is a great way to mm -hmm. just dip them in there, take a look at it. And... What's this one? Because it's like shiny. It's like sandish. Give it jazz it around and oh yeah, you can jazz it in the light. Yeah. Super pretty. I think I even got some petrified wood in here. I didn't know to expect that. Is this red mica? I think it is a mica. I'm gonna say yes. Mm, let's go with that. Red jasper. There's a lot of things to go it? through here. There's this Arabic stone. It says patterns and color look like Arabic writing. Did we get one of those? I don't think so. Arabic stone? Is that what? No, that's a jasper. Oh, that's an opal. Arabic, Arabic writing. Yeah. Mm. I don't think we got one of those. Oh, it just gives us another reason to order again. <laughs> oh, there it is. There's this one. Oh. Yeah, so I think they said this was green mica. Yeah, I'm going to go with green mica on this one. That one is so pretty. So gorgeous. That's so shiny. Not going anywhere near Tumblr. I know. <laughs> no way near. Okay. And then there's right. lots of little garnets and stuff in here. I mean, there's there's too much. We would just talk and talk and talk. That one is yeah, so blue. That is like painfully blue. Okay, let's open yeah. the big ones. I want to open the big ones. Oh, thanks. Okay, you're welcome. Skizzers. Oh, yeah. I like these, guys. I think that to add to the fun factor of going through this and finding these treasures, the fact that these are wrapped up and like stuck throughout there is very yeah. addicting and fun. Like yeah, That was fun. Yeah, well was done. Fun. I was like, ooh, another pink package? Yeah. They're like double wrapped. So you got your, your bubble wrap on it mm -hmm. and then it's like wrapped in this other, what is that? Ooh. What is, ooh. ooh. Bam! I'm gonna say blue. Oh! Just kidding. She got me. Just kidding. <laughs> she really did. <laughs> a blue calcite or a blue fluoride. Calcite. Gonna, oh, that side's prettier. Oh, there's beautiful shine to that. I love that these are pre these are pre cut to just put up in your office to just put and out. It's, yeah, it's flattened uh -huh. so it can stand nice and easy. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Super fan. Love it. This one came in a box. It's in a box in pink bubble wrap. It's like they knew girls were going to be opening it. They're like, let's, let's do the pink bubble wrap. I appreciate that. <laughs> oh, I just literally flicked a piece of dirt into my eyeball. Be careful, guys. Danger. Maybe safety glasses? 
gem. <laughs> Save the glasses for gem opening. Oh, okay. Ooh. It's weird the color changing effect. Oh, and it's you can oh you I this is the camera's not even gonna do it justice. You can see through this. Yeah, I mean, it's like reflectively like oh. reflective. Um, guys, I like we can never remember the name. What is the name of the the shape? Yeah, we were trying to come up with it earlier, and I don't know why that's such a hard name for me to remember. I can't remember either. We'd love if you let us know down yeah, in the comments. Yeah, please tell us. Gosh, guys, I wish you could see the difference when you shine a light behind this. This is gorgeous. Oh, so pretty. Love it, love it. What do you think that is? Well, my handy dandy little sheet says that... Um... Benzo? <laughs> Benzo? Benzo? Look at that. Um, is it zebra dorite? Maybe. Zebra-like appearance? It's, I could see that. Is it a natural agate? This could be an agate. This could be an agate. That would be giant agate, right, guys? That'd be huge to make one of these. Okay. Um, Yeah, I'm just gonna, that's what I'm, I'm gonna go with one of those two. I love it, rock. It's an I love it, rock. I'm addicted to these. I think that's how I'll set it down, just like that. I love it, rock. Yeah. <laughs> it's not as clever as Angela. Sorry, guys. <laughs> <laughs> All right. So, guys, once again, this was uh, Metadora. Metamora. Metamora. Gem mine. Gem mine. Based out of Indiana. We'll have links provided below. Um, I think, you know, I only talked about it for a second, guys. You know, we said $165 for this bucket, which I loved this bucket. I think it was definitely worth it. But they have smaller, way more affordable um, bags of pay dirt that you can start off. So, like, say you're just a little curious and you want to know if it's something you're going to love, spend $25. And then you do have to pay for the shipping yourself. But the fact that they use UPS is awesome. It's I a love bonus. it. It came so yeah. fast. So fast. And you guys, once you order it, you want it immediately. You want it that second. <laughs> uh, fun factor. I'm going to give it a 10 out of 10. I had fun. Yeah. I think that all my fun factors are probably going to end up being 10 out of 10. <laughs> she does. She loves this. This is too much fun, you guys. Great, great way to spend an afternoon with your best friend, your Aww. children, your partner, if you guys are both into it. Um, I would order this again and again and again. All right. On that note... Uh... Don't forget to hit that like, subscribe, and notification bell, guys. Sharing is caring. Mm -hmm. And we'll see you guys every Tuesday and Friday. Bye. Bye.